Hi, my name is Matthew Ferry, and I want to tell you about three actions that guarantee your happiness. Now, how did I come to these conclusions? Well, you need to understand that over the last 17 years, since 1993, I have coached more than 8,000 people to be productive and effective. I mostly focused on entrepreneurs and salespeople and worked with executives on, you know, how do we, how do we take your business to the next level. And what I found out was happiness is really one of the key elements to being extremely effective and productive. So these are actions that will help you to get into happiness. Now let's just back up for a second. I just want to let you know that happiness is a skill that anybody can learn. So most people believe that happiness is, you know, some kind of circumstance that that is outside of yourself. You know, when I have this, then I'll be happy. Or if this thing happens, then I'll be happy. If I, uh, you know, a lot of people think that happiness is a formula. If I am, you know, watching the Super Bowl, having a cigar, drinking a drink with a, uh, you know, hot girl on my side, man, then I'm happy. And those. Formulas certainly have their momentary hit, but long-term happiness is really just a skill. It's, it's really a shift in the way that you're thinking about yourself and about your circumstances in life. So nothing needs to change to make you happy. Nothing needs to change. Nothing at all. So here are three things that you can do, three actions you can take that will make you happy. The first one is called devotion. Now devotion, what does that mean, devotion, right? Am I, am I gonna get devoted to something? No, it's a way of being. See, doing what you're doing in the moment to the very best of your ability. Doing what you're doing in the moment to the very best of your ability. When you're operating from that standpoint of really focusing in, and doing your best, if you're doing the dishes, if you're walking the dog, if you're playing with the kids, if you are hanging out with your spouse, if you're with your friends, whatever it is that you're doing, that you're focusing and doing your best in the moment, it is mind-blowing how much happiness that creates. The second thing that you can do is acts of service, helping others, helping, contributing, making a difference, supporting, any time that you, you take your attention and you take it out of you and out of your head and you move it out there into the world, all of a sudden your happiness rises. In other words, when you consider this, your unhappiness is just a self-centered focus. Your unhappiness is just a self-centered focus. So by getting your focus out there and serving others, your happiness is going to go through the roof. And then the last thing is appreciation. Looking at things in a new way. Finding what you like about people. Finding what you like about situations. Looking for what you like about yourself. This is really anti-mind. The mind, all that talking in your head, it's not focused on what's right, what's working, what you like, what you're happy about. It's not focused on that. It's a survival mechanism. So its job is to look for what doesn't work and then focus on those things and of course that makes you unhappy. Devotion, service, and appreciation. Those three actions will get you happy.